And welcome back on this Friday morning. Quickly go over that forecast simply because you may as well just start pairing up after today. We've got rain, rain, rain in the forecast. Today's going to be beautiful, so no worries there. High temperatures of 94 with your low of 70. Tomorrow, though, 70% chance of showers carries on into Sunday. Temperatures sticking around 87 for your high tomorrow and then 82 on Sunday. And possibly Monday's going to be A-OK. -okay. Maybe we'll skip that rain the rest of the week back in the 90s. Now, you know, even though I know it's Jamie's birthday, there is a very, very nice uh, vehicle we're about to show you after we share this video of the Corvettes, the remaining video of the Corvettes that were in Athens. Stay tuned. You're going to want to see this in just a moment. We'll be right back. Tell me all about it, Gary. Don't act scared. <laughs> How many from Athens are in this? Well, I don't know. Probably me and my wife. Uh, there's, there could be some others I'm not aware of. I was, uh, we're from Madison, originally from Athens, and uh, we were asked to uh, coordinate the stop here since there's about 250, 275 Corvettes from all over the southeast passing through on their way to Bowling Green, Kentucky, the National Corvette Museum, uh, the 20th anniversary. We have one of these uh, caravans uh, once every five years. So the next, one, the last one was in 2009. The next one will be five years from now. Do y'all go to the museum every? We five go to years? the museum. There's a big bash at the museum on the Labor Day weekend, and uh, so we're headed that way. We'll be there today. We're going to be brought in with a caravan uh, and. Uh, and, and be there for the next three, four days. So did, despite the mayor of this city, did everything go good here? So far, And you great. went to school and with his wife? I did. I did. So how many, about 200-something? 
It was about 250 from all over the southeast, from Texas, uh, Louisiana, Alabama, Mississippi, North Florida. It looks like most of all these are new Corvettes. Well, Corvette owners like their cars, so they, they <laughs> tend to keep them, keep them pretty new and pretty fancy. Y'all yeah, come back in the caravan too? Everybody no, disperse. Everybody's going to disperse once we get to, uh, to uh, Bowling Green today. All right. Well, thank you, Gary. Thank you. Good morning, Jamie. Uh, happy early birthday. Thank I brought, you. I brought you a little gift over today. Uh, it's in salsa red. I figured that was your Alabama red was your favorite color. I'll tell you what, I'm not sure we're going to be able to get Gloria out of there. Happy birthday, baby. She, uh, she, she is enjoying this beautiful 2015 Jaguar F-Type V6 supercharged convertible. And yes, it does have a sweet, sweet exhaust. It, it does. It really does. I haven't seen a single one of these in Athens. You haven't? No, that's right. I wanted to come over and show it off today. Uh, my good friend Jimmy Bryant over at uh, Jaguar Huntsville, Century uh, Jaguar, they uh, were kind enough to let me uh, bring this over and showcase it to you. Had nine miles on it when I picked it up. Uh, for 109 time you take it back, right? uh, No, I was cautioned to not uh, drive it too many miles, but uh, this thing is so beautiful. It really is. It's got the, uh, the upgraded uh, wheels and brakes, um, every kind of creature comfort. I think Gloria likes this car, Jamie, I'm telling you. Um, now these guys over there really do a good job. They've got uh, they've got a lot of vehicles and a lot of selections, but this new F-Type. You, you made the comment earlier when you were looking at it, Jamie, that it really didn't even look like a Jaguar, and that's that's really the theme for Jaguar is they've really tried to get back to a, a unique look. I, I was having a conversation with somebody the other day, Gloria, about how all the cars look alike nowadays. You know, you can't tell uh, a Lexus from a Hyundai, from a, a Toyota Camry to a, to a Mercedes. You know. Well, they all look the same. <laughs> yeah, it does. It really does. And you do have a little bit of a trunk in this car, Jamie. Not much. Um, dual exhaust coming right out the center. But uh, yeah, I'll show you the trunk right there. Look, I was able to even able to get my uh, my backpack in there. That's about it. But um, but yeah, uh, this this again, this thing is a uh, uh, retail on this is about eighty nine thousand. That's, you know, it stays under 100. I was telling Gloria, I think my first house cost less than that. Uh, Mine was on wheels. Your house was on wheels. But uh, just a beautiful, horn works. Just a beautiful ride. One more time. Listen to that exhaust. But... Uh, Maybe they'll let me keep it throughout the whole weekend and take it to some of these car shows that's going on this weekend. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Uh, we do have some good shows this weekend, Jamie. We've got the uh, Elkmont High School Band Show is this weekend. That's a big show. A lot of door prizes, a lot of activities. I think we've got a live band for that. Uh, Jasper Mall down in Jasper, Alabama. Is that your old stomping grounds? They've got a car show this weekend, and then also in Huntsville at Drake Technical College, uh, Drake Avenue, they've got a car show this weekend. So sad news is, as Gloria told us earlier, I think it's going to be raining tomorrow, but maybe it'll hold off enough for some of these uh, car shows. But get over and see Jimmy Bryant and the guys. Jaguar Huntsville, if you're interested in one of these, I'm sure they'll hook you up with a test drive, Jamie. I'll tell them that you and Gloria will be over there Monday to talk with them. That's it. <laughs> 